everybody, it is I, Mr. Charlie Moore, and welcome back to the Jedi Knight episode something. I I didn't check. I should have checked. But at least I'm keeping on top of the the smuggler and the Sith Inquisitor episode numbers because they're exactly the same. But the Jedi Knight, I think it's like episode 18 or 19 or something. I think. I don't know. Anyway, last time we were asked to rendezvous with Lehan Narez. If you remember, she's going to come in from one end, and I'm going to come in from another end because there's some activity going on in here, which could be Imperial activity, and we're going to go find out now. Deference crash site. Hi, Imperials! How are you? You are right? Oh, don't tell me we're going to have to do some leveling up. Oh, God, don't do this to me again. Ooh, an easy bonus mission. How exciting. Oh, I should probably put my buffs up. I always forget to do that. And I might as well put up an experience boost as well, which I do have, I was going to say, which I don't have, but I do. Ooh, going to blow this up. Don't mind me. Well, it's, uh, that did nothing. Okay. Oh, you, okay, okay, you got, you got, you got frozen. All right, fair enough. But nobody else did. Fine. Nearly at the end. Uh, still got a little bit further to go. And, of course, I can't stealth either. Because I'm a Jedi Knight. Jedi Knights can't fully stealth. I mean, they can stealth stealth. But not properly. Not, like, fully stealth. They can only do, like, force camouflage. But, you know, the thing is, I don't have this ability on my Jedi Knight. Because I've got the wrong Jedi Knight. I'm a Jedi Guardian. I'm the tank version. Great. At least I've done the bonus mission, though. Destroy the Imperial Blaster Turrets. Oh, that should be easy. And even, even so, is it really a bonus mission if it's kind of mandatory? If I kind of have to do it? Because I can't, you know, in a phase, you can't run run away from the enemies. You have to attack them unless you exit the phase. And you can't enter a cutscene until you've killed the enemies. So, not really a bonus mission. Okay, both done. Liha, 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 you're up there. What are you doing up there, Liha? I can't get up there. Damn it. Uh, uh, there we go. Impatience got the better of me. I blundered in here like a Padawan. The heavy turrets were an unpleasant surprise. You know how many patients I've treated for heavy turret wounds? Zero. You're one in a billion, lady. You were surrendering, Jedi. I suggest you keep that promise. Huh? Give us a moment, please. I need to explain the situation to my friend. I obviously missed a lot. Give me the short version. I sprung a trap. The end. Turns out, the Imperial in the Hollow is more interested in capturing than killing us. Keep him talking. Trust me. My patience is at an end. Lay down your weapons or my men will destroy you. Those uniforms. You people aren't standard Imperial military. I am a member of the Emperor's personal guard, as are the men under my command. The soldiers you face are specially trained to kill Jedi, and they outnumber you. Perfect timing, yeah? Not anymore, Imperial scum. They tricked us. Kill everyone! You should have technically have been shooting as they were zip lining down. Just gonna point that out. Yeah, but you know, it could have saved your lives, shock troopers, but never mind. Never mind, eh? You were dead anyway. Look at all of this. Carnage. Wow. It's immense. How is it this guy's not dead yet? It's like seven against one. How is this possible? Oh wait, there's more. I thought there was only three. Not four. Oh well. Rusk. Got here as soon as we could. Had to engage some Imperial patrols in our way, but nothing serious. Nothing serious? Privates Vanth and Edda don't know what day it is. We're lucky to all be alive. Shut it down, Private. I don't tolerate insubordination. Uh, I'll restore discipline? Listen up. You signed your lives away when you joined the Republic Army. Complaining won't change that. The Empire wants us dead. You can run or kill them first. If you're frustrated, take it out on the enemy, not your commander. Appealing to hatred? That's one way to inspire the troops. You love me, really. I don't want any of you throwing your lives away, unless you take ten times as many Imperials with you. This is the scientist's vessel. And look what I found hiding under a dead Imperial officer. 
The rest of your unit is dead, Imperial. Start talking, or you'll join them. Please, I don't know anything. I'm just a computer tech. Hmm. The Empire sent you here for a reason. Let's start with that. My job was to slice the databanks of this old starship, but the White Moor beat us to them. They lifted the whole network. The pirates stole the ship's databanks? They took everything valuable, but they missed the computer decryption file. They can't read the databanks without this. I'll be taking that. The White Maw maintains a depot inside a crash dreadnought. Everything they loot goes there. White Maw has its own dreadnought? It was a Republic flagship during the war. The White Maw moved in, but doesn't control all of it. The pirates secure their depot with ray shields. We'll have to find some way past them to reach those databanks. The Midi scouted White Maw territory. They located two reactors buried beneath the ice. They're no doubt powering the ray shields. If we destroy the reactors, we can enter the pirate depot. Sergeant Rusk, head for these coordinates and destroy the reactor there. My friend will destroy the one at these coordinates. Will I now? And you're not coming? Are you planning to sit this one out? We can't leave the Imperial here, and he's a liability on a combat mission. You're twice the warrior I am. I'll escort our prisoner to the Republic outpost near the Starship graveyard. The Medes will perform reconnaissance on the Dreadnought. When both pirate reactors are destroyed, meet me at the outpost and we'll plan our assault. May the Force be with us. Not with Rusk. I highly doubt that he believes in the Force. Uh, which one do I go for? Which one do I go for? I'm going for the Crystals because level 36. Woo! Level 36. Woo! -hoo! Level 36. Yeah, I don't know why I sung that. So I don't get that. I've just sort of quick traveled here so that I could, uh, you know, get there easily. But why should I go there rather than there? Surely this area is closer. Because I'll sort of pop there. Otherwise, I'll be popping here. I don't get it, game. You know, it's funny. I was watching a TV advert today. My internet provider, they were like, oh, reliable broadband at now 73% off the price. Reliable. Yep, unless it's Bioware servers. Unless it's Bioware servers, but I've not seen anybody complain about the servers just yet. Uh, let me read the chat, maybe they're complaining about it now. Um, nope, the 11 people on Hoth. Well, there's two phases. There's a PvP phase as well, but none of them are complaining about the latency. Um, I guess I'll check Reddit later, but we'll see. It's probably my internet. I mean, last time it wasn't, I found out it wasn't, it was actually the servers, so... See? Now look at that! It's pretty much plopped me right outside where I need to go. Just need to walk a few meters. Otherwise, if I were going there, I'd have to go all that way instead of like over there. I mean, seriously, game, what is your plan? You're trying to make me travel a million miles? Waste my time, are ya? There's a thought. What's my, uh, played? Nope. Oh, I'm trying to turn the chat on, thanks. What's my played on this character? I have played on this character for 15 hours and 29 minutes in total. Where the story has probably spanned, what, a few months, I guess? Eh. Oh, why is that light? Where's the lightning coming from? Um, I mean, this is where I need to go, but I want to know where that lightning is actually coming from. What is causing that lightning? <laughs> um. Okay, it's literally just coming out of nothing. It's just coming out of the ice. Okay, let me get into a safer area and then holla communicator. Hope this isn't a bad time, Master Jedi. Well, there's lightning coming out, out of the reactor, wall. But General Grain just alerted me to a secondary objective. The White Maw has a series of munitions dumps here. Scouts report those weapons are headed for the Dreadnought. General Grain believes the pirates are reinforcing. He ordered me to hit those munitions dumps. Thought you might want to join in. You handle the pirates. I need to rendezvous with my fellow Jedi. Understood. I'll double time the men through this and meet you ASAP. Rusk out. Eh, I can't be bothered to do that. No, Doc I... will understand. You still want me to stay alive even though I'm refusing to service the Republic? Yeah, I'm telling everybody else to service the Republic. Alright then, Doc. Make me fight alone. Wait, disable the... Oh, I was going to say, I thought it was telling me to go right back out, but I need to go this way. Let me guess. You're gonna be a bonus mission, aren't ya? 
Well, as long as it's kill 10 or 15, I'll happily do it. But if it's kill 30, you can go to hell. 20, you can go to hell. Don't see me, don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. Ah, oh, what did I say? Okay, don't you see me. Don't you see... What? I... <laughs> it's going to happen again, isn't it? I'm going to end up doing this bonus mission automatically because they keep getting in my way. I mean, I'm trying my best to avoid them, but... Why did I cancel that out? Oh, well. So look, I've already killed ten of them, and I'm only about halfway there. I still got to climb. So over there, and there's some more enemies in my way. I might as well just do the bonus mission! Ah! Ooh, something blue! Oh, we now have something borrowed, something old, and something new! Uh, was that just a companion gift? Uh, no! Something for Dark 3 or above? Well! I'll get to Dark 3 at some point. I don't know when, but at some point I will. Incoming. Thank you! Guess what? Enemies incoming too! Oh, I need three. Oh, there's only two here. Why is it? Right. Whenever I need three, I only get two, meaning I'm going to have to kill somebody else. When I only need one, I get like four or five enemies. I just... Uh... Well, hey Elite, looks like I'm going to be killing you. Oh, you look like Skadge. Well, you can die painfully. Is that racism? If I say that because you look like Skadge, you can die painfully. I mean, is it if it's not a real race? If they don't really exist? Ah. Uh, oh well, thanks for the experience. So long and thanks for all the experience. Ooh, I got 9,000 experience there and 7,000 experience and... Wait, and 17,000? No, just 7,000 and 9,000. Cool! So I got 7,000 for killing him and 9,000 for killing him. Don't you love it when things work out? And we need to disable the reactor. Who are you? Are you... You Imperials, you look like you're... Oh! A Jedi? Never killed one of your kind before. And you never will. It reminds me. I should buy some armor. You should. This should be interesting. Ah. Uh... You want to give me all your weapons and abandon this facility. <laughs> you got a strange sense of humor. Hey, what are you idiots doing? Get back here! Ha 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 ha! Stupid hawks. Don't know what you did, but I'm not leaving. White Maw bosses kill deserters. The Gendai got no regard for life, not even their own. Of course, it's easy for them. They're indestructible. All living things die. Not Gendai. The bosses can take anything. You'd see for yourself. If you wasn't about to get killed, you got backup. I don't. Means I won't have to go easy on you. Never expected you to go easy on me. So, you're actually properly telling me that they will never die. They will literally never die. Oh, wow. You died easily and you're frozen in time. Your death will forever be frozen in this cavern. And so will your soul. So, yeah, is he literally telling me that they'll never just wither away and die? At all. Everything does. Speak to Liha Narez. Where is Liha? Oh my god, he's disappeared! <gasps> Where's Liha? Um, do I need to run? Um, probably. Okay, Liha's actually going to be at the outpost I need to be at anyway. Ooh. Makes it easier for me. Liha! Liha, 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 Liha. Ooh, your droids. Are they all my fans as well? The medias report the pirates' ray shields are down. Our goal is within reach. Any sign of Sergeant Rusk or his men? I expected them back by now. I'm sure they'll arrive shortly. If not, we do this without them. I'm not certain that's possible. If the medias' scouting data is accurate. Sorry to keep you waiting. We sustained heavy losses achieving our objectives. Squad strength is 33.2%, but we'll make do. What's the next mission? I'm not going anywhere. Following you maniacs will just get me killed. My squad mates survived two years of fighting on Ord Mantel. One day serving you wiped us out. Saving the galaxy requires sacrifice. We're all expendable to the mission, soldier. Uh, mm. I mean, I don't know. I know Kashida's dark side, right? But... 
So he tells me even she could probably see something is happening with Rusk. You know, everybody's getting killed with being with Rusk. So that's what I might gonna say within reason. I mean, yeah, she doesn't want every. You know, she she likes the Republic. You know, she I, I say she likes the Republic. She likes the Republic. She has some respect for it, but she's really just hating on it. But I guess within reason, Rusk. Within reason. The fatality rate in your squad seems high. Maybe we should exercise greater caution. Hesitation loses battles. So does insubordination. This private clearly needs medical attention. We can't send him back out like this. I'll find volunteers from this outpost to complete our mission and restore your squad to full strength. You're dismissed to the med center, Private. This is a full scan of the Dreadnought. The technical readouts are currently under minimal guard. Unfortunately, that area lies directly between two large forces, White Mob Pirates and Imperial Strike Teams. Which side has the advantage, the Pirates or the Imperials? They're at a stalemate. The Imperials have superior heavy weapons, but the Pirates are unnaturally resilient. Scans indicate the Pirate leaders are an alien species known as Gendai virtually impossible to kill. Sounds like a challenge. I will secure the technical readouts if you and Sergeant Russ keep those forces occupied. Which enemy would you prefer to face? Wow. I... Uh, get a choice. I can go to the Imperials or the uh, Pirates. She has no time for Pirates. She wants to kill the Imperials. Those troops are the Emperor's personal guards. I'd like to know why they're here. As do I. Their presence here is disturbing. Leave the White Mob Pirates to me. I'll make sure they don't bother you. Here are the coordinates to intercept the enemy forces. Once you engage them, I'll retrieve the technical readouts. Sergeant, let's get you some reinforcements. Perhaps I should do the talking. If you insist, Master Jedi. Be careful facing the Imperials, my friend. May the Force be with us. Okay, you can you can come out of saluting now. Just just to tell you, and those mediums must be getting so dizzy. They're just spinning around and around and around and around. They must be getting so dizzy. Right, and now we've got the long trek all the way over there, and then we've got to go there, and then we've got to go there. Let's begin, shall we? Oh, to think we are past the halfway point. For the Jedi Knight. How long ago did I start this series now? Oh, it must have been months and months ago now. And we're still only about halfway there. We're just over halfway there, I should say. Oh, my word. I'll get there eventually. I mean, my smuggler and my uh, Sith Inquisitor, I think, are catching up. Yeah. Okay, so the enemies are level 40. As long as there's no level 41s. We should be okay. I mean, we're getting near enough to level 37. I'm definitely going to have to do some leveling up after this episode. Um, but we should be okay. Oh, and another reason why I should be killing enemies is because they count towards achievements, don't they? I, mean, I wonder how many pirates you need to kill for the achievement on Hoth. Let's find out, shall we? Could be worse. This cave could be full of man eating wampas. I mean, they're pirates. It's not, right? I don't know, but they're pirates. They're kind of the same, aren't they? What? Who, what, where? What? I'm trying to look for an achievement, damn it! You're interrupting me. 8,000 experience just to kill that one guy. My word. Um, aliens and mercenaries. Wipe more, I guess. Oh, there we go. I think this is what we need. So we've only got another 130 to go before I get that achievement. Exciting! I love how I have to attack pirates anyway to get to the Imperials. It's great fun. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna try and sneak by. No, no, I can't sneak by. Alright. What? You saw me too? Oh, for crying out loud, everybody's seen me. Whoa, what a death that was. She smacked you to the ground as if it was WWE. I really gained 1,000 experience per enemy killed. Oh, there's another one as well. Uh, can I just leave it for you, Doc? Yeah, I'm just going to leave it for you for a second. I'm just going to take a break. 
Well done, Doc. I got the experience for that. Well done. Okay, I'm guessing there's going to be some Imperials in here as well. And there are. You and I'm... Alone. You're not going to fight alone. And i got to go all the way around too. Oh, and it's a bonus mission too. Well, since I'm going to have to do it on the way anyway, I think I'll do it. Hello, Emperor's Guard Jedi Slayer. Is that really a title you get in the Imperials? In the Empire? Wow. I want that title. Well, hopefully by the end of this area, we should be level 37 and people will be more easier to kill. I say that, but they probably won't. Don't make me fight alone. You're not fighting alone! Stop saying that, Doc. Level 37, thank you very much. And now I just need to kill uh, one more Emperor's Guard. Well, where is it? Is it you? Hi! I'm feeling a breeze on my forehead right now. I've got a fan on, but it's not pointing towards me. And every now and then I just feel a breeze on my forehead. See the fan rebounding off like a door or wall or something onto my forehead. Oh, it's a ghost. It's a ghost. Okay, bonus mission done. Lovely, 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 lovely. Hi, Imperials. I hoped you would come. Our prior meeting terminated unsatisfactorily. Surrender, and you will be treated well. Resist, and, well, you know the rest. Why take me alive? What does the Emperor want? Even if I could answer you, I wouldn't. I serve my master's will. Not much of a conversationalist, is he? I gave you a fair chance, and you refused it. Men, kill this Jedi. You do realize your master wouldn't be happy, the Emperor wouldn't be happy if you did kill me. So you need to bring me back alive for the Empire. Emperor, Empire? Em Emperor, there. Well, you know, you, you obey your master and uh, suffer the consequences. I mean, you're going to die nonetheless, so uh, yeah. If the Emperor can enter the afterlife, he's going to punish you to crap. I'm going to take the loot. Anything good? Imperial tags! Great! Rusk will love those. I think. I did it! I secured the technical readouts of the Emperor's Fortress. They contain schematics of its entire defense grid. Between this and the cloaking device prototype you recovered on Balmora, we have everything we need to capture the Emperor. Heard anything from Rusk? How did his squad make out? The sergeant is alive. The rest of his squad? I'm not sure. Meet me at the main Republic base. Liha Naraz out. Okay, I'll take that, thank you. And when you say the main Republic base, what do you mean? I mean all the way back over there. Thank goodness for quick traveling. Liha, are we done? Oh, that's your meaties. It's a wonder all your men survive such an enemy. How did you defeat the Gendai? Superior tactics, and a dozen thermal detonators. If that Gendai is still alive, I guarantee it wishes it wasn't. I love how it's like those and they. Yeah. We couldn't have done this without you and your men. Your service has been exemplary, Sergeant. You and your men brought the Republic a great victory. Sergeant Rusk and my cooperative Jedi friend. We finally meet in person. General Grain, been a while. Hard to believe you and I started in the same squad. Still a ground pounder, huh? Wouldn't have it any other way. It's honest work, sir. I didn't realize you and the General were comrades. We had some short-lived adventures back during the war. You can hardly tell that left leg isn't real, sir. The medtechs did good work. The 88th Armor Battalion is on its way. The 301st Infantry is being rotated back to Coruscant. I Lovely can't waste there. a soldier like Rusk on shore leave, so I'm assigning him to you. Okay. For how long, sir? Until the Sith Empire is defeated. So, never? Yeah, you're, you're stuck with me forever then. I'm not sure what further need we'll have of him, but he's welcome to join us. If nothing else, he can guard your ship. <laughs> the transfer is effective immediately. Good luck. My shuttle is small. There's hardly enough room for myself and the Medes. Perhaps Sergeant Russ should travel with you. Be honored to. Look forward to learning from a superior warrior. Excellent. I will deliver these technical readouts to Master Braga. You should contact him as well. May the Force be with you, my friends.
Okay, we need to speak. Oh, we need to speak Sergeant Rusk. Okay, hi. I'll requisition my gear and meet you at your ship. Uh, okay. Grab a bunk and make yourself at home. As ordered, Master Jedi. Oh, well, that was that was the most pointless conversations I think I've ever had in this game. Okay, yes, please use my ship's holo terminal, and then we'll be done for this episode. Hello, hello. Master Braga, Liha Nerez is on her way with the technical readouts to the Emperor's fortress. I knew you two would be unstoppable together. I'm not sure what to make of her notions about droids using the Force. Nor do I. Then again, great advances in knowledge often come after a leap of faith. Exactly. Your successes on Hoth and Balmora have been nothing short of extraordinary. Our plan to capture the Emperor is already taking shape. Come back to Tython, my friend. We'll discuss the particulars here. Master Braga out. Which we will do in the next episode. Ah, that was a bit of a long episode, wasn't it? Well, I don't know how long this is. I guess it's like 30 minutes long, 40 minutes long. But anyway, I'm going to go play Bioshock, because I assume my Bioshock collection has arrived in the mail. I have no idea. It probably hasn't, because I'm very unfortunate. My mail sometimes doesn't arrive till like 2 o'clock in the afternoon. But, I'll go find out anyway. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen, and I shall see you next time. Any farewell to you.